Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to your girl's channel. My name is Naomi Amber. If you're new, what's good, what's poppin', it's lit around here. Make sure you subscribe, root 10k. That's the whole spiel. Make sure you like this video. You haven't even watched it yet, but I'm sure you're gonna love it. I'm sorry, that was like a mile a minute, but seriously, please be sure to subscribe to my channel. I am on the road to 10k, so if you like what you see, if you like what you hear, just do your girl a favor and hit that subscribe button. But today is going to be a Fashion Nova haul. Nothing too crazy, just gonna show you guys some items that I decided to pick up, and I think there's some great pieces in here. I'm really excited. It's gonna be a quick haul, but nevertheless, still a good one. So let's just get right into the haul. So first things first, we just have this dress, honey. I wore this dress over the weekend. It's just this really calm, like mini dress. It does zip all the way up like that. And it could be a little bit more casual. Um, and you could wear this. I personally would wear this to go get errand, do errands. Like I feel like this can be transitioned from like daytime to quickly be transitioned to Hold on, the zipper stuck. Okay, so yeah, I feel like this could be easily transitioned from day to night with the simple zip up, zip down. Like, it's a vibe. I wore this with um, my black Comme de Garcons. It could be a vibe, any kind of way you try to put it. So, really glad I got this, and I think it was fairly inexpensive. I hope they have other colors, because if they do, I might go back and get them, because this was really a vibe, and she was fun. And it's pretty short, so if you're not on the inch away from Grace and Glory team, you might not want to get this dress. Because <laughs> I will tell you right now, it is pretty oh, short. And so. Next, we just have some shoes. These shoes are literally to die for. I'll show you guys like how they look on the feet um, and the try-on portion. But here is the shoe. It just has this square toe, but it does like this really unique like tie at the top. It's just such a feminine shoe like I am in love with this shoe and the heel is flared so it makes it way more comfortable to walk in um, I'm loving this new trend of this flared heel okay if we can all get behind this then I know that our feet will stop hurting as a collective well they'll still hurt but they will stop hurting as much as a collective if we all agree to the flared heel I do have another pair of shoes that I want to show so here they go it's just these platform shoes and they do have this a double strap here very much Lizzie McGuire vibes like that's all I'm gonna be serving all summer 2021 and it's these and I have a lot of black and white so I feel like I will have no problem being able to style this and I don't have any black platform shoes so I knew I was in the market for these platforms have come back in style and I have no shame in saying that I have joined that bandwagon. So let's move on to the next item. The next thing I got, I got it with brunch in mind, like a brunch fit, a brunch outfit. But when it came, I don't know if it's giving what I thought it was supposed to give. Like just this oversized shirt dress. It doesn't button also. So it just looks kind of like an apron. I don't know. I also don't even think that it's super long. Okay, it is kind of long. I don't know. We're going to have to see. Maybe it's the size that I got. No, I got extra small. Okay, yeah. I just don't know if I'm really feeling this one. I just don't know. It's probably the color on camera, like the stripes. It looks like yellow and white stripes, but it's more so yellow and cream. And I think if it was yellow and white stripes, then it would have me. But I don't know about this one, y'all. The next item that I'm going to show you guys is just this really basic crop top, but it does have some details on it so it does have shoulder pads and then it also ties in the front um like does like this little knot thing it's a very casual shirt but obviously like the shoulder pads and like the little tie kind of elevates it kind of looks like something that you could have made yourself but obviously you didn't um and i just plan on pairing this with some you could really dress this up or down you could dress this with some jeans and some black sandals or you could dress this with some jeans and some black heels like either way it go it's still gonna look nice <laughs> like i really do enjoy this i love a good basic as you can see I love something black so that ain't no thing but let's move on so the next item that I got I was quite excited for it but unfortunately she did not fit so it's just these shorts and I had this problem a lot when I order shorts online it's just these shorts and I really wanted the style of like the rips going all the way up the leg and just being longer in the back but they do not fit me around my waist like they're way too wide um so I will be selling these I'm so sad that I did not fit these. I did get a small. I know it comes in extra small, but that was available on the website. But shameless plug, do follow me on my Poshmark because I do sell 
some of my items from my hauls on there that didn't fit me or I didn't end up liking. The next item that I got, again, with brunch in mind, I saw this girl on YouTube also do a fashion overhaul and she wore this in her haul and I was like, oh, I gotta get it. I gotta get it. So I got it and it's just this green um, jumpsuit. I live for a jumpsuit because it's so easy. Like, you just need one piece and it's the top and the bottom. Like, I how can it's such a lazy girl staple definitely gives grown women brunch and i decided to leave the buttons like super open you could button them up but it does kind of like i don't know the more buttons you button the less cute it get does that make sense so i left it buttoned all the way down and you can also cinch the waist here too which i think is really nice and it's super long so it's tall girl friendly and i would just wear this with some white heels some nude heels work I would personally wear it with white heels though. So it could be more brunch and fun and you know, lively. Um, and maybe even a white bag or a brown bag. Some brown shoes. Hold on. Next, I just have this set. So excited for this because I will definitely be wearing this on vacation, okay? Without a single doubt. It's just this ruched set. Oh my God, showing it up on camera is going to do it no justice. But it ruches here at the bottom. You can control the ruching at the bottom. And then the top is just like a... It's just this nice bandeau top. And you can scrunch it up as much or as little as you want. Holding it up um, does no justice. So you guys will just see it in the try on portion. But the skirt is super long. It definitely gives grease. It's giving vacation. Like, if you don't buy that and you don't wear it on vacation, there is something wrong. Like, it has to be something so wrong. So the next thing that I got... I saw the model wear this... Um, short muscle tee with the shoulder pads in it um it's not a bodysuit or anything so it's just a regular tee um but she worked with like a corset and some jeans and i thought that was so cool i think that it's a pretty cool way to style it and dress it up and make it look a little bit more different but that's why i got that piece so next i just got this midi dress it is white but here's the thing I did not realize that the straps would not be twins like these are sisters distant cousins this is a thin strap and then this is a thick strap so this one is a bit confusing to me and my homegirls so she's definitely gonna get sold I just I can't get behind it the quality is great though it's not see-through at all it's a nice length I just don't understand the Mitch match straps I can't that's not something I can get behind and it would be a different story if maybe like this strap went over this way but it doesn't it's not even enough space to do that so I'm kind of upset because I do need like a staple white dress so it's okay but let's move on. The last three items are just some basics that I decided to pick up so the first thing that I got is just this crisscross um halter kind of vibe bodysuit now that I'm looking at it, I really don't know if this is going to fit me, but I really do hope it does because I was really excited for this one. But yeah, it's just this plain white bodysuit again. Holding it up doesn't know justice, but I think like this triangle shape is really trendy for summertime. Like this triangle shape you will not see popping out no other season but summer. So really excited I got that. And then next we just have this swine colored really basic bodysuit i'm loving super basic bodysuits right now like just with some jeans and some sandals like it's a quick fit i need quick fits i'm always going out doing some running a quick errand so i always struggle with trying to find something really quick and easy to wear i probably could have gotten away with getting an extra small but small is probably fine and then i don't know about the see-through ability of this but i don't think it'll be too bad but we'll see just gonna just just gonna pair this with some jeans Nothing too crazy. And then similarly, I just got this chocolate brown bodysuit similar to the last one. I don't have anything. I have very little things in chocolate brown, which is kind of strange because I do have a lot of chocolate brown accessories. I am chocolate brown. So I just feel like I need a little bit more chocolate stuff in my closet. I don't have enough. So I had to get some more. <laughs> and like I said very similar to the last pair again I got this in a size small could have gotten extra small but it is okay Whew. even though that was a little bit of stuff I still feel a little bit winded but nevertheless thank you guys so much for watching this video make sure you like and subscribe for your girl cuz you know I'm on a road to 10k all that good stuff and I will see you guys in my next video bye